box. Uh, sink. Wait. Nope. That's Cancel that. 60. Cancel that sink. Going for this next one. Sink. Welcome to Tomba. We're at the Dwarf Village. Let, let me speak to your elder. Oh, I can just go past it. Yeah! We have acquired Dwarf Elder! On behalf of everyone in this village, please allow me to thank you for saving our friends and family. I love you. Can't you see? I have no pants on back here. You could never notice from the front. Ha ha! Can you tell how much I like you? Now come here. I want to show you my evil pig bag. Here it is. Blue evil pig bag. Congratulations. So yeah, that Frozen trailer. Yep. Um... I've only seen Frozen once. Me too. And from what I remember is that... She's cursed with this ice power? Yep. She had a curse. I don't think yep. it was a curse. And they, she went to a dwarf? Or the, the trolls to get rid of it? With the power. And then... No, they, uh... She had an maybe she's born with it. They... Maybe it's ice powers. <laughs> she, like, hit her sister with it, and that's when they went to the trolls. To save her sister, to then. To save her sister, because she was hit by the ice powers. Right. It was before or after they built the song. It was when they it's, were it's really after little. They built a snowman that looks exactly like Olaf, but it's before they built Olaf. Okay. Before Olaf, Olaf was sentient. Yeah, before be one, before sure. Olaf was sentient and like had a speaking and whatever. But this new one, it's setting up the stage for like the Four Seasons character, like Avengers style, coming together to fight yeah. an evil. Because if you look at like the title I card. The big, I remember the Like she's training herself essentially. Like the beginning part where she's on like the running out of the ocean and or like, the wave and kind she's of trying to like, yeah, she's she trying to be stranded as well. Yeah, she could have been stranded. That's another reason that she might have been doing that. But, but the uh, whole the whole trailer takes place in like this place where it's all fall colors. Well yeah. the synopsis says they go to like a faraway land for this and, whole adventure. Is and this gonna be like the last airbender? That's what I'm thinking. They're gonna the that'd be cool. They're just gonna the find the, the wind avatar person or whatever she's like, in the trailer didn't he gonna be like fuck you Nickelodeon well there's a couple right? people that are new in the trailer there's a boy she, and there's like, like a girl who does the leak thing well I don't see her do it she kind of just watched it happen if you it's really quick if she does it that'd be cool it's prop. I mean it looks like it's definitely gonna be like you see her like do something as well as like follow with her eye. Head. But what I what I what I thought would have been really interesting for them to go down the path of like Elsa being the ice queen and her sister Anna being the fire queen because she's got the red hair and it would just be a cool duality of like their powers and them being sisters like that's what I thought like she embodied the winter and Anna embodied the summer and then they're meeting now with the person that embodies autumn and then they're gonna meet another person that embodies springtime. Can I just say that computer like animators have finally nailed water? It looks really, really good. Do you know what they did in the first Frozen? What was really cool? They invented snow physics for shows, or for like, like they invented a whole new way of rendering snow to make it look realistic. Like they animated or they put parameters in for like a ball rolling down a hill and they put inclines and they just put like a little pebble of a flake of snow and it just tumbled into an actual snowball yeah, as it rolled down the hill in, right. in real time. That's all. Awesome. More snow rolled down. And I think they're going to try to do that with these other ones where it's like they're going to get wind physics right. and they're going to get more water physics. Was, yeah, water in this trailer was really good. First time I really noticed really good ass water in a movie was uh, Okay. Water in that was just as as animated like stylistically that one was it did have a lot of really good like all the plant life the texture on it was just so good. I remember thinking it that I, it's kind of a weird one to bring up, but the the Pokemon movie, the first like Pokemon movie, mm -hmm. when they did that intro when they're searching for Mew, there was a shot of like the water and like bubbles. Like that was the first like scene was like I think it was Mewtwo doing an or it was one of the scientists doing a voiceover 
and you see just like a bubble come up and then you see like them going through a jungle mm -hmm. and there was like a stream and I think you get to see like the particle effects in that water and that was just drawn. I thought that was really fun or really like well well put together. And drawing water is cool, but like seeing it rendered in like a three dimensional space is like really fun to look at. Mm -hmm. I just watched the Frozen 2 trailer again. It's not clear where that the wind thing is coming Yeah, from. like it just passes by some chick. And then it lifts yeah, a dude up. Lifts the dude up and yeah. So you don't really see who's doing it. I'm guessing but that. Those being two new characters, there's a good chance that one of them could be like doing that, having to. One or both. It's like they're airbenders. And he's just like practicing. Yeah, Woo! Well, he's getting lifted up. Yeah, he's getting like, lifted he's, up. It's coming from somewhere. At him. And maybe, him maybe it's, it's her. Somebody. Maybe it's her, whether she's a princess, like actual royalty or not, like Elsa is. I like how the trailer there, like, doesn't. Well, the other trend of character just watches it past her. There's no like. I'm talking context. Narrative, like, thematically, narratively here. Oh, okay. um, maybe it's her that she has wind powers like that and it's her brother instead of like her sister that doesn't yeah. that way they can continue their branding of like this being a movie with strong female characters and leads having the other powered people be other females in this world and uh, get her own little like let's go moment or let it let's go <laughs> let's go <laughs> let's go her own like let it go moment where she like Maybe first discovers them or something kind of just like similar happens where that she can't control it and it's getting blown out of proportion and she like blows her blown out of proportion just blows her brother up <laughs> blows um, her brother just blows her brother <laughs> no she can't control it she's she blows, blows her brother and she's like sorry I just blew my brother we just saved the doors we're gonna go to a new area but we're also gonna unequip saw that uh, Sony or whatever has or the creators of it in Spider Verse that made the the source for the the source code or whatever material for the animation style public. Oh yeah, that's sweet. That's awesome. Yeah, that's really cool. I'm sure that there's a lot of animators out there who will immediately take advantage of it and just make some really cool stuff. Yeah. I'm just like here you go, bitches. Have it. Be it. So it's like it's open source. So that means like yeah. they can distribute it. Like the people that create with it can just give copyright to them, or what does that mean? Open source. Would that mean you? Use it. Okay, so there's no like no, copyright. It's not, like proprietary. Right. It's like uh, fucking what's the other studios could use it. Open source shit. Is it Unreal that did that. Somebody did some fucking. Um, open source. Unity, I think. Yeah, uh. Well, like. The Source Engine, right? Yeah. Like, that, well, that's uh, Half Life and like yeah, Half Life, Counter Strike for their like that's a proprietary. Uh, we have a choice to make here, gentlemen. What is it? Do we go left into the laughing or like I think it's maybe the evil mushroom forest, or do we go left into the mushroom forest, or do we go right to Windy Mountain? Turn the water, shade of pale. <laughs> this will tell us right here. Let's go look at the map. I almost never shade knew that this was here. Yeah, yeah mushroom forest. You never go on the mushroom forest. We can go over to the windy, windy valley. I say mushroom forest. So you got split vote here. The dank cloud valley. Mushroom forest? You said mushroom forest, I said windy valley. So it's a split picture. Oh, no, I asked you guys. You've never... did. I said, I said, I said mushroom. Because <laughs> he wants to listen to me. Yeah, I hate this. <laughs> this is bad. I, hate the I don't even mushroom. care, dude. Yeah, but they don't look like that shit. So whatever. <laughs> I like the little demon cloud bag thing up there. Demon cloud bag. It is. It's what like a, it's a little sack. Oh, Yummy. Oh, it looks like a handle. <laughs> what is this psychotic piece? The this mushroom is, forests are eating mushrooms. Shit's going weird. This is like touch fuzzy, get dizzy. Yeah, kind of. But like, eat mushroom, get fucking bonkers. Fuck. Rip. Yeah, I told you should have got them out. Pay, pay attention to those flowers. Try gain. So right now, I haven't eaten any mushrooms in here. 
Yeah. Which is normal. They just like fuck around. <laughs> They're chill. I don't They're give a shit to later. And then depending on what mushrooms I eat, it like raises and lowers the ones in the back and they join in on the fun of the emotion. So I can either be happy or sad. Yeah. No middle ground. If I eat those mushrooms. The big old DSL. Lips, oh, oh, damn it. I didn't want to come out right and say it. Oh, those are fucking DSLs. We're back to the Oh my god. <laughs> if you eat the mushrooms, holy shit. You can't attack anymore. Your attack button just becomes expressing whatever emotion you're feeling right now. That's a, still a funny mushroom. Sad ones? They make you cry. And when you're running, it'll just randomly trigger if you have an emotion on you, either happy or sad. Really? But the, the crying one sends you forward, so sometimes you'll be like near a ledge. And you'll just sudden, run off. Uncontrollably, you just run off because he cries. Oh my god. Or the laughing one, you just stop in place and you're like, <laughs> right there. Such a, a weird. <laughs> Mechanic. I'm not. I'm not making him do that. He's just doing this all on his own. Running a little bit. Does it wear off though? No. Oh my god. You have to find some way to stop it or change the other one. Or die. Or die. Every time you come in here, there's like one healing mushroom. I think that's fun. I already got it. <laughs> me, me. Yeah. Ooh, yeah. I like how he ran. <laughs> just, yeah. Poor guy. Having a little tantrum. No, no. Well, that was Tomba. It was. I hope we get to pick There's this up at a later. We might be able to pick this There's up later. More Tomba. Yeah. We're like. Oh look, it's it's shaved chimp man I don't know. again. It's not that long, ago, <laughs> so we could probably do it again. But he's gonna take us sailing away to the next part. We'll meet again in that next part. We'll meet again. Boat trips take a while. They do. Come with me. We'll see you guys later. We'll sail off. We're to the sailing new... to the next episode. Stop the episode!